Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. This is React JS video tutorial series. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain how to restrict the user to allow only the letters or characters in a text box control. And here we got our final output of our application with two text box controls. The first text box control contains the actual logic to enter only letters. Below the text box control, you can enter numbers, characters, and symbols. Let's type here and the capital letters, numbers, and some symbols. And now I'm copying this text which contains all the numbers, characters, and letters and pasting here. And notice the output in this text box control which contains only letters there is no numbers and symbols even if i type numbers or symbols it's not typing printed here if i type letters it's printing so let's check again see if i type the numbers it's not printing even the symbols I'm reloading the browser again. Now let's enter below the text box control some numbers which contains all the numbers between 1 and between 0 to 9. Now I'm copying this text, the numbers, and I'm pasting in the above text box control. Notice we got only numbers between 1 and 5. Notice if you see any after 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, uh, 0. It's not printing in this text box control because we have written the logic to enter the numbers between 1 and 5 only. Let's check again 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. See here, we got only 5 numbers. Only. If I type 5 again, it's printing 4, 3, 2. If I type 0, it's not allowed to print the text. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Before continuing this video tutorial, I sincerely recommend please watch my previous ReactJS tutorial series. You can find those video tutorials in my channel playlist. Now let's continue the today's tutorial. I'm using Microsoft Visual Studio Code to create a ReactJS application. Just for the time saving, I have already created one. ReactJS application which is a CHK mul insert. Now in this application I am creating one React component inside this source folder. Before that let me expand the source folder. I click the mouse, new file. The file name is only letters.js and here we got our JS file. Now in this file I am creating a component, the class component. But before that, we need to import the React class from the React library. Import React or is capital here, React from React library. And of that, I am defining one class component only letters extends component. After that, this function return uh, render. Let's add the render method. Inside this render method, I'm adding the return, which displays the output. In this return method, I'm adding the do component, which is a main element of our component. Let's add some headers. Restrict user to allow only characters or letters react.js tutorials after that i'm adding horizontal line now after the horizontal line i'm adding on simple input type is equals to text let's add the placeholder um, enter some text enter some text now let's close this element of that 
export default my component only letters now let's save this file now before implementing the to accept the letters only in this text box control first let's check the output how it clicks the designing part on the browser before run this application the most important step is we need to configure our component in our application index.js file open that one if you notice in our index.js file the render method contains one uh, my previous component name which i'm deleting here i'm pasting the new component which is only letters now let's add let's import only letters save this application save all now let's run the application to run the application from visual studio code we need to go to view let's click the terminal and here we got our terminal and make sure the path contains the project which is uh, here in my case my project name is chkml insert and the folder name is example chml values now let's application start nudget package manager and pm start enter and here we got our, our first basic output with the headers and one text box element right now in this text box control i can type characters numbers and symbols but my aim is i want to restrict the user to allow only characters other than the characters i will i don't want to type here so let's switch over to our coding part uh, what we'll do is we'll put this in a center tag so everything uh, the headers and text box control will be placed in the center of the browser now what i'll do is i'm adding on constructor whenever we add constructor there is a method called super so once we define the super we can create a properties so this dot state is equals to between curly brackets i'm adding the property called value the property name value which we enter in our text box control so at this moment this let's make this empty the value colon between single quotes let's close this uh, with the colon so now whatever the value enter in this text box control we will get this from this property now after that there is a event we required char allow is an even name now in this event i am adding a logic to enter the user only the alphabets so for that i am using set state method this dot set state method uh, let's define one variable input text colon the values we are getting um, e dot this e dot target target dot value dot replace replace forward slash between square brackets i'm adding a caret symbol and small a small z and capital a and capital z and this validates the user inputs to allow only the the small letters or capital letters only letters a to z which is globally and g is globally comma that's it now in the here the value between the value we are getting from this input text this dot state dot input text input text and also we have to add the event on change event is equals to this dot 
my even name is car hello dot i'm binding to this on change event that's it and also what i'm doing i'm adding one and horizontal line and one simple text box control input type is equals to text let's close this one now let's save this file save all we'll check the final output i'm reloading the browser and here we got our final output of our application with two text box controls the first text box control contains the actual logic to enter only letters below the text box control you can enter numbers characters and symbols let's type here and the capital letters numbers and some symbols now i'm copying this text which contains all the numbers characters and letters and pasting here and notice the output in this text box control which contains only letters there is no numbers and symbols even if i type numbers or symbols it's not typing printed here if i type letters it's printing so let's check again see if i type the numbers it's not printing even the symbols now suppose if you want to print i want to type only the letters between a b and c only so here the condition is a to c let's save this file save we check the output here i'm typing all the characters some random characters b j c now let's copy this one and paste here and notice the output in this text box control only prints a b c only the rest of the letters it's eliminated it's not printing because our condition is to use a allow input only a b and c characters only in this text box control the same thing if you want to allow the numbers between 1 and 5 One to five. Let's take the user to allow only numbers between one and five. Save this file. We'll check the output. I'm reloading the browser again. Now let's enter below the text box control some numbers which contains all the numbers between one and between zero to nine. Now I'm copying this text, the numbers, and I'm pasting in the above text box control. Notice we got only numbers between one and five. Notice if you see any after five, six, seven, eight, nine, or zero, it's not printing in this text box control because we have written the logic to enter the numbers between one and five only. Let's check again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. See here, we got only five numbers only. If I type five again, it's printing. Four, three, two. If I type zero, it's not allowed to print the text. That's it. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe my channel.